Valdereth. Valdereth. My arch enemy, we meet again. You, you've always been one to win the dire roll, Valdereth. You, with your lizardy type picture and your 60 card deck. Look at you, efficient as always, picking only the best cards for your deck and minimizing your deck size. My goodness, he's back. And so are we. This is a pretty powerful bunch of cards, but you can't really play Night Vale Spectre with a Muta Vault. Um, I'm gonna keep it. Actually, he's got a really fast deck. I, I looked at his times and it's like, I win in one. Oh no, it's gonna be Black Red Aggro. Oh no! So we have a decision to make. Do we put Muta Vault out now and block his 3 1, or do we just go with a Night Vale Spectre plan eventually? This is going to get dicey when he starts playing haste dudes. Like this turn. 3-1. 2-2. Okay. That's less bad. He'd have all but I'd done nothing. Thassa God of the Sea is an interesting draw. Um, maybe we're intending for her to draw us into some kind of island. <laughs> Uh, that's fine. Four damage isn't too bad. Um, still not my favorite thing. Very, very fast deck. Okay. I think it's Nightfield Spectre and a Master Waves. Stop the bleeding. What's up, says Nightfield Spectre. Young Pyromancer is an interesting one. I like that. Here's a kill spell. Dread, Dreadbore. Wow, okay. Sure. Those have, do those have face? No, they don't. Okay. Tidebunner Mage is an interesting one. But I don't think it does anything for us. I think Master Waves gives us two guys. So a potential blocker for a young Pyromancer holds him back. And you'd start picking off Ash Zealots, and then after that we can play maybe Tide Bender Mage plus Thassa. That sort of seems right. I mean, Dreadboard doesn't hit him, so... If anything, it's one blocker forever for sure, unless he's got Doomblade. Master Wave says, what's up? I don't need Devotion to be awesome. Kill the elemental? Nope. Okay. I don't block this elemental token with this elemental. Because I can make him a 3-2, which blocks these guys forever. Be a timid red player and don't attack. That's my favorite type of red player. <laughs> Magma Jet that guy. That's That's cool. That does give him a, just a bunch of damage. He'll be able to finish me off with burn after this. Frostburn weird doesn't do it because we don't, this isn't an island. So I would, I would play these two, probably, and then a big master wave after that to block all these things. I think having an additional three blockers is what we need to do. Two of which are immune to all of his red spells. If we can just stabilize here... He, he knows exactly what he's doing. Oh, flying guy, fuck. <laughs> I think that was in the game. So block, 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 two, three, four. No, it doesn't. It's close, though. And then I need to play this on that, and then make him not draw a, another burn spell, which I think is going to be impossible, but what can you do? I need to get rid of an elemental for a young pyromancer, and that, that don't like that very much. If he just attacks with the phoenix, I think we're in better shape, but he still I still die to lightning strike afterwards. <laughs> 
Valdareth, you fiend. What is this? What is this mono redness? Yep. Definitely come in. This is advisable. Or don't. Just stack with Shadow Phoenix. I'm cool with this too. Alright. Get me with whatever burn spell you want. Um, I think I have to use Time Enter It's my only answer to Phoenix right now. And then I've got Mita Vault available as a 4 4 if I need to block another thing. Another's Phoenix is bad for me. Another burn spell is bad for me. Magma Jet doesn't do it, but Lightning Strike does. It's going to be hard to become offensive before he draws a burn spell. <laughs> it's going to be very hard. Island is good. Island is very good. I think the answer is Frostburn Weird Thassa. Six attackers. Two. Three, four, five, six blockers. And I'll attack with the Master of Waves. Oh, or I could play a. I could have played Biden. No, oh, I'll play Biden out next turn and make him attack into me if, if uh, I don't die next turn, and I draw an island, and all the stars align. It is a burn spell. Oh, there it is. Oh, okay. Type yeah. That's that's not a horrible move. It's a pretty good move. I think it does it for him too. Yeah, it does. Two, and then I block one, two, three, four, five, and then three more. That's five damage total. Good on you, sir. I'm going to let him do it too. He deserves to beat me like that. Bring it on, Red. Yep, there's no way I can stop this. Okay, there we go. Chapow, 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 chapow. And dead. If I had not attacked, it would be still four damage, so. Alright, sideboard time. It's a lot of elementals, so Ratchet Bomb is kind of appealing. Rapid Hybridization is fun though, because then I can do a surprise 3 3, and 3 3s are super relevant. Dispel seems pretty good too for the, all of the Magma Jets and Shocks. So let's do that. Instead of Cyclonic Rift, because he's got Haste Dudes. He is Dread Boar, so... Is Jace... worth it in that situation? I know he's really good against Aggro Dex, but so is having all these creatures. <laughs> so maybe I do go kind of... I'm on the play, so... I think I'm going to go with... kind of a faster plan. 